hello welcome back to my channel if you're new you're welcome and i hope you stay so today i feel like eating some spring rolls so let's just make some let's start with the wraps i'll get a big enough bowl and i'll come in with some flour i'm using cake flour i'll come in with a pinch of salt to taste i'll grate in some nutmeg I'll go ahead and give it a good mix. Next, I'll come in with some water. Using my hand mixer, I'll just whip it up till I get a smooth mixture. So, after whipping for about two minutes, this is what we have here. I love the consistency. As you can see, it's on the watch rate side. So I'll put a pan on medium flame. Using my silicone brush, I'll just dip the brush into the mixture and just brush it into the pan. Afterwards, I'll just let it cook for about 30 seconds, then I'll flip it over and cook the other side as well. After everything, this is what we have here. I'll set this aside for later. It's time to prepare the filling. I'll put a pan on fire and come in with some oil. I'll come in with some garlic and fry it till it turns brown. Next, I'll come in with my minced meat. I'll cook this on medium flame for about five minutes. I'll come in with my favorite seasoning, curry, ginger powder, white pepper, dark soy sauce. Then I'll come in with some chopped onions. Some chopped green pepper. some cabbage so I'll stir fry this on medium flame for about five minutes so it's been after about five minutes I'll put off the flame and I set it aside for later now I need to prepare my glue to do this I'll get a bowl and come in with some flour I'll add some water and mix it up with my spoon. Now I'm going for a very thick consistency. So yep, 
This is okay, I'll set this aside for later. So I'll get my wrap and come in with about a tablespoonful of the filling. I'll put the glue at the edges of the wrap. And just go ahead and roll it close. Afterwards, I'll just secure the ends with some more glue. So after wrapping up everything, this is what we have here. I'll put a pan on fire and come in with some oil. When the oil is hot enough, I'll just drop in the spring rolls. So don't forget we're doing this on medium flame. I'll fry it till they turn golden brown and I'll just get them out of the hot oil. So after frying everything, this is what we have here. You need to give this a try. They are so delicious. I mean, when it comes to the filling, you can put in anything you want. If you're vegan, vegetarian, you can do without meat. So I hope I did help you and I hope you are going to give this a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye!